you know what, Minecraft doesn't make any sense, like, the logic in this game is just so unpredictable, you know, and here, let me show you, okay, we got a water bucket, you know how Endermen are, uh, I don't know, scared of water for some odd reason, they, they, they just take damage from it, but, uh, here's the thing, you put a, you put a cauldron down, you put water in it, look, 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 just swims in it. What? How? That, that makes no sense at all. You want to know something else that doesn't make sense? Here, we're going to take a snow block and we're going to take this as well. You ready? Breaks, right? But then... Huh? 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 What? What? D -d 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 no, it doesn't... No, no. What? It, but, what? What? Okay, so this thing, the same thing as this, does not... Okay, how about this? If I break that? Okay, that makes a little bit more sense, but what? What? All right, now let's look at the beacon. I have a block here, and you know how if there's a block on top of a beacon, it doesn't work. But then if I put on a shovel, and I make it a path block, what? That literally makes no sense. And you're ready for this one? Oh, wait, these are total legs. This is probably the heaviest block in the game. Uh, watch this. D -d okay, no effect. But here, I'm, I'm gonna clean up my entire inventory. And matter of fact, so I gave myself feather falling for a boots and a potion of slow falling. So we're just gonna equip this down right here. We're gonna look, look. You ready? Hold on. Sometimes it doesn't work. Hold on. And there we go. It literally does not make any sense. What? Now let's do some crafting. I feel like making a. Hmm. Let's see. I want to make a staircase. Okay. So I'm spending six wood for four stairs. And keep in mind, this is 75% of a, of an oak. Here, here, I'm gonna show you. You know what? I don't even need numbers for this. This is, use your eyes for a second. Does that look right? Hmm, no. And I only get four of these for six of these. And here's the stupider thing. I want a button. Oh my gosh, you ready? Where does the wood go? Where does the wood go? Here, we're gonna, we're, we're gonna make a pressure plate. Okay, you ready? One pressure plate! <laughs> that, that cost it two of these. Two of these for that tiny little thing. Hey, are you ready for this? Hold up, hold up, hold up. <laughs> oh my gosh, do I need to spawn more wood in for this? So two of these cost it one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I'm gonna do that so you can get... No, no, these even have holes in it. What am I, how, where did the extra wood go, huh? You ready for this? Don't you hate it when you have to make a gigantic uh, sheep farm just to make carpets, and then it costs three of this for two of these? Does that make sense to you? Do you always get mad at that? Because I know I do. Why do I need 120 sheep just to maintain a half decent? Let me, I have to use those carpet duplicators. Oh my gosh, any ready for this? This doesn't do damage. I mean, well, I don't need to prove that. Just go into the game. Everybody knows that. But, like, you ready for this? Hold up. Why does nobody talk about this? Look, it's blue fire. Why is it orange on me? It's blue. Why is it orange? Here, what would you, huh? Okay, so you know how uh, if you put a stone slab and another stone slab, it acts like a full stone block, and it is actually logical that it blocks a beacon because it's like a real stone block, you know what I mean? But uh, we go ahead and start mining this. Here, I'll put myself in a uh, game mode zero real quick. And, uh, well, it's cobblestone, right? One, two, you ready? You ready? I'm gonna get cobblestone, right? Nope, I get two specifically stone slabs, not even cobblestone slabs. Also, you ready for this? You ready? Yeah, that's pretty dumb. Alright, so you know the nether star, right? Yeah, we're gonna drop that down right there. And, uh, you know how it's all blast proof? You know, it can withstand a TNT blast. It's perfectly fine. But, uh, a beacon here, here. You know what? Literally encased in obsidian if I could yep encased in obsidian and nether star when it comes to a beacon you ready this adds on obsidian which in case you didn't know is also blast proof but it's gone where'd it go also following the same logic as this game uh, likes to put it where'd it go where'd it go also why does uh a stone axe do the same amount of damage as a diamond axe. 
But literally, Netherite does one more. What? What? Alright, so I made some stuff here. And yeah, I made all this. And we're just gonna go through it. So, you know, the water bucket, right? And I'm gonna put this right here. And, well, that's a chest. And that's a very tiny little uh, thing. But we're just gonna go up here, okay? And we're gonna set our game mode. Yes, this height will kill you. So we're gonna go to game mode survival real quick. And, uh, that, that, that's why I'm alive today. Yep, that's why I live another day. Uh, totally makes logic. Now, I want you to look at this, okay? Cactus. Gets destroyed by cactus. Alright, you ready for this one? I'm gonna take another right pickaxe, okay? And that's only if my screw reel will actually work on my mouse. Okay, look. This is a TNT thing, alright? TNT minecart. What? Why did that? <laughs> what? What? D that thing landed directly on me, okay? And this is the TNT minecart radius, okay? But let's use that same logic. You got, you got, okay, we, we're gonna use iron bars. This is pretty much how it is, okay? We're gonna dig one right here, and we're gonna put iron bars around the TNT, because that's how it works in the minecart, okay? Also, uh, misplaced. Uh, and I'm gonna join, oh my gosh, my score wheel. Uh, we're gonna do that. So that's like a TNT minecart right there. You ready? Yeah, I'm gonna try to mine this. And we're gonna be right next to it. How? This compared to this. This one didn't even kill me. So, what? And this? No, and what? Alright, I don't really have much to say about this one. We're just gonna take an anvil. Alright, you can see where I'm going with this. I put it on top. I break this lovely piece of oak plank. And, yeah, potatoes. But, but, apparently, since I'm so fat in this game, look how fat I am. I haven't eaten since, uh, like, what day is it on here? Hold on, that's a screenshot. That's F3. Oh, crap. I don't even know my own controls anymore. Look, I mean, just look for days. I haven't eaten. And, what the heck? Wait a minute, this game. There. It, am I fat? Fatter than an anvil? How much do I weigh? And we're just gonna take this. I don't think I have arrows, so I'm just gonna go into game mode, uh, uh, creative and uh, watch. There's clearly a gap here, but I should have a uh, you know, I'm gonna shoot at the bruh sign. You ready for this? Right, logic. And you ready for this one? I know you are. Boom, we're gonna take this right here. We got our nice eight iron worth of armor right here. And we're just gonna, we're just gonna smelt this thing. You ready, guys? You ready? So this cost me eight iron uh, ingots, which is a lot of iron when you think about it. Hmm. Yep. <laughs> totally how it works, Minecraft. Totally how it works. So uh, here, let me let me show you how bad this is. You need nine of these to create one ingot. You need eight ingots to get what I just got. Yeah. Don't use furnaces when trying to smelt down armor. It's just not worth it. Sigh. 